Welcome back guys, Nightsparks here, and today we are playing some more of Tiny Tina's Wonderland. And today we're going to do another side mission, so let's see what we got here. We got this help ask, let's do this. Go now, adventurer, to the sea floor, where at a most restless spirit cannot, well, you know, rest. rest. Yeah, I got it. Not until his lady love can also rest. Do it for love! Ugh. Okay. Whatever, I ain't judging. Right, so let's get to the overworld. We got quite a we got we got loads of side missions to do. <clears throat> this kind of feels more like a DLC, even that it's hours long. I don't know, it's just you know, DLCs go a little more out there and do crazy shit. And this just yeah, feels fully like that. I'm really loving it though, so right, where are we going? We've got two locations. Okay. Um. Oh, okay, this hence the same place. Okay, so this should be where I fought the pirates, right? Oh, I didn't really fight them, I made them fall in love or something. Hey, little devil. Yep, this is the place, so where am I going from here? I'll do. Hi there. Oh, you're a ghost. Oh, I get it. You have you come to redeem me? Maybe. I would know that which distresses you. You are kind to stop the fire. It is more than I deserve. Keep my truest love. Yara, she pays a price which should be mine. If you would aid me, I would bid you to fall. One moment, I'm sorry, I have to deal with this shit. Surface dwellers to feed their sacrificial rites yeah. since age forgotten. And all that time I have been here, not but aghast, unable to stop them. Okay. But I can be of some assistance. I will grant an injustice yeah. to their temple. Rude mother. Gaze now upon the fields of dead, victims of the coiled cultists. Oh, yeah. Didn't see them. What's he talking about? No, uh, dead. dead. The skeletons. Oh, right, 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 right. My bad. Okay, there's lots of gravy stones. Like a lot. Oh. Like a lot, a lot. Like, we get it. Is a lot. Wait a minute. Gravestones? <coughs> this used to be the bottom of the ocean. Good point. Make any sense. It's called scene setting, Valentini. Based on your arsenal, I assume you will not blanch at your task. No, not you really. Slay the coiled Tizox. And retrieve the five pieces of Yara's voice shattered by the dark magic. Okay. Open the door then. The fiends! But why her voice? They twist her angelic voice into a dark resonance which summons the fell serpent. Curse them. They befoul Yara's memory. And in doing so, they bind her soul to this mortal plane. Okay. And will rest until she is free. All right, I'll deal with this. <clears throat> that fateful day, Yara and I were enjoying a midday sail. She was singing me a song of such beauty that I nearly wept. Then the sea roiled around us. Deal with this fucker. You'll have to excuse the little one. All right. Fucking hate these ones with the shields. You should have yielded when you had the chance. Whoa. I don't know why the fuck he's here. Who else is left? No. Oh. That's one. Wicked, coiled, and in a flash, the 
I snatched my beloved from the deck, dragging her below. Alright. And why are you down here? Did you follow and then realize you can't breathe underwater? Cool. So he's kind of like telling us a tale of each piece. Right there we go. So I guess these guys are just teamed up with the skelly bobs. Alright. We plummeted into the blackening sea. The creatures raking me with their talons. But I did not let go. My lifeblood swirled round me, salty brine burning in my lungs, but I did not let go. Yes, yes, you're a very fierce class, I know. Yeah. You have been just found wanting. Yara was the last thing I saw as my vision faded. Okay. Face twisted and wide-eyed in terror. Wordlessly pleading, but I could not save her. I failed. I'll take that. Some more you fuckers to deal with. Now does she left. Right, where are we going next? This. What the fuck am I getting up there? I'm gonna. And prepare yourself, for only through the crucible of Grisnasak's death will Yara's voice be mended. Sure, this will go wrong. Pretty cool. It comes. Oh, good. What's this? Alright, well. Where is it? Got that. Whoa. Yeah, I'm dealing with some buddy. Well, well, well done. What an agony it must have been for Yara <laughs> to have her soul bound in darkness, her voice riven from the weave of her spirit. But we will make it right. All right. You just open the fucking door, buddy. There we go. I hear oh. nothing. Her song. That song she never sang for me. Alright, well, you're gonna die. Even, more beautiful than I remember. Even that you're a ghost, I'm sure. My dearest Yara. To my great and eternal shame, I could not save you in life. But even in death, I have not abandoned you. I only pray that my actions this day will finally grant you the peace which you have been wrongfully denied for so very long. Okay, do I just put it 
Please, make her whole again. What shall I slay evil with today? Orin, oh. it is time to let go. Nora, but I've only just gotten you back. We can be together again, but you must let go. Again, Sierra Marjorie flashbacks on this. Let go. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, that's kind of nice. Alright, guys, I hope you enjoyed. And don't forget to like and subscribe, press notifications. I'll see you in the next one. This was fun. We helped them reunify. I was expecting something bad to happen, but uh, yeah, nothing bad happened. So, yeah, guys, bye.